something inside me is awake. And I need help. I've seen this raw strength once before. It didn't scare me enough then. It does now. Let the past die. Kill it if you have to. That's the only way to become what you were meant to be. Everybody set. Three, two, one. Action. Episode eight. Gosh. The first film didn't even have a number. Ryan has written a story that's unexpected but right. Some of the stuff that happens, people are going to be like, oh, my God. Even though I think I know it all, they throw things at me story-wise I never could have imagined. And even though everybody knows that it's the second in a trilogy, it feels like its own thing. Star Wars is so cool because there's all these creatures and all these amazing visual effects. But all the characters are also so complex. Ryan needs to work on his walkie sounds. <laughs> Ridiculous. New director. I can't even just learn a walkie sound. It feels like the storylines are becoming more established. We're really getting to know these new characters also with the characters that we know and love. We're seeing their lives change. Everything is being shifted in an opposite way to what the audience expected after Seven. Ryan's made Star Wars fresh and new. I'm hoping it'll be a little shocking, but I'm hoping it'll feel real and honest. It's our most ancient story of good against evil, told in the most fascinating way, but it has a real spiritual depth to it. It's about family, and that's what's so powerful about it. <laughs> 